Do you want to disable OneDrive on your Windows 11 PC? In this video, you will know how to disable OneDrive in Windows 11. Is OneDrive required in Windows 11? No, it is not essential to run OneDrive on Windows 11 PC. It is an optional feature that you can choose to enable or disable as desired. OneDrive is a cloud storage service that comes pre-installed with Windows 11. However, you can remove OneDrive fully from a Windows 11 PC without compromising any other features of Windows 11. Why would you disable OneDrive? OneDrive can be helpful for those who use cloud storage services, but there are several reasons you may want to disable OneDrive on Windows 11. The first reason could be, you don't want to back up your files to the cloud. Another reason could be, you are worried about the privacy of your data. Also, if you are not using OneDrive, it keeps running in the background and keeps consuming resources. So these are the reasons you want to disable OneDrive. How to pause OneDrive on Windows 11. If you don't want to completely disable OneDrive, you can pause the service instead. This will stop all synchronization and background processes while still allowing you to access your files on other devices. Look for the OneDrive icon in the system tray and right-click on it. Then click on the gear icon and select pause syncing. You can select between 2 hours, 8 hours, and 24 hours. Now the OneDrive won't sync for the selected duration. You can also put your internet connection as meter connection. OneDrive won't sync on the meter connection, but on the meter connection windows, 11 won't download the updates also. Though you can enable the download update on the meter connection from the settings. To do that, open settings. Click on Windows Update. Then click on Advanced Options. Here enable the option that says Download Updates over Meter Connections. Now you are good to go. How to disable OneDrive on Windows 11 Startup If you don't want OneDrive to start automatically when your PC boots up, then you can disable it from the startup list. Open the settings. Then click on Apps. Then select Startup from the right side. Here locate Microsoft OneDrive, then use the toggle switch to disable it. Now the OneDrive won't start with your PC. How to unlink OneDrive from your computer by unlinking OneDrive from your Windows 11 device, you can disable it even more effectively. This is a great option if you are sure you won't need OneDrive anytime soon. Look for the OneDrive icon on the system tray and right-click on it. Then click on the gear icon, then select Settings. Then here select the Account tab. Here you will see Unlink this PC option. Click on it to unlink your PC. How to permanently uninstall the OneDrive from Windows 11. If you want to permanently remove OneDrive from Windows 11, then you can uninstall it for good. Keep in mind that this will delete all the local files stored within the OneDrive folder, and you will not be able to access them anymore. Open Settings. Then click on Apps. Then from the right side, click on Installed Apps. Here search for OneDrive. Click on this three-dot menu and then select Uninstall. Confirm your action and OneDrive will be gone from your Windows 11 PC permanently. That's it for this video. If you have any questions or suggestions, drop them below and share this useful video with your friends. Like the video and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to press the bell button to receive alerts for videos on Windows tips and tricks.